All right, La Familia. Que pasa contigos? Contigos? Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Join us YouTube memberships. Holidays are coming up. It's the perfect uh, stocking stuffer for you and yours. <laughs> Can you imagine? You get a stocking stuffer for your spouse. You're like, uh, I got you uh, YouTube memberships on Ro uh, Roadie Footy YouTube page. All right, dude, you could have went the other lane, buddy. Oh, my God. Very inconsiderate people here. Tony Montana, ¿qué pasa? Señorito. Señor. Tony Montana. All right, fam. Day 32. Honestly, pretty surprised we made it this far. I'm going to be very honest with you guys. I'm kind of proud of myself. I hope you guys are proud of yourselves. Um, tomorrow will be exactly one third of the way through these lives. Shaggy Ann, haven't seen that name in a minute. How you doing? And if anybody's wondering, ooh, it's so cold, guys. Like in the movies, you guys ever seen in the movies where like the steam is coming out of the, uh, the what you call it? Uh, the sewer grates. <laughs> They're coming out, baby. Bring them out, bring them out. It's hard to yell when the steam is coming out. I had to remix that to make it appropriate. Okay, so even though, yes, guys, it's 43 degrees out here in Rhode Island. Am I wearing shorts? Yes. Am I wearing a short sleeve shirt? Yes. But am I wearing a puffy vest? Yes. Do I have the heat blasting? Absolutely. There's briskets in here. Are we on our way to get milkshakes on a cold ass day? Yes. You know why? Because when the world says why, damn it, I say why the F not. <laughs> I don't know if I say that. I don't know. But um, yeah, we out here. Jeannie, hello. Brisket, everyone. Hi, guys. Brisket's just chilling. He's had a long day. Satin, hello. Lindsay, I'm happy we're waiting for this. Hello, guys. Hello, Lindsay. Melissa. Hello, Melissa. Angel in the building. Carrie. Guys, the chat thing is fixed. Thank God. Thank God. So what we're heading to is, um, I don't know if we've had this before. I'm having like deja vu sometimes and I just don't know what the heck is happening. Are you done shaking from being outside? We're good? Are you nice and warm? All right, daddy's gonna turn this down a little bit, okay? Feels like a furnace in here. Um, supposedly Chick-fil-A brought back some peppermint jump off and I've been craving and a milkshake and to be honest with you Chick-fil-A is the safe bet right now I've always I, I don't think I've ever had a bad milkshake from Chick-fil-Izzle we might get some chicken nuggets for you know who over here you guys know what I'm talking about the little baby prince little puppy chulo um, also I have a lot of friends, and I don't know about you guys, I have a lot of friends that are going through seasonal depression right now. I mean, it is getting dark at freaking 5 p.m. How the heck is that? We need to stop that. We need to stop the whole daylight savings and then take off daylight savings. I think the only reason we did that back in the day, and it's the whole reason why school is only not in the summer, is we used to work the fields back in the day. We don't work the fields like that anymore. We don't, we don't work the fields. Brisket isn't out there with like, like the oxes used to, right? He's not out there plowing. Brisket's not moving around lumber. I'm not attaching lumber to his back and saying, you know, like the sled dogs, let's go. We're not doing that. We're not doing that anymore. The only thing that this is doing, it's messing with people's mental health. That's all it's doing here. Unless it's by purpose. Listen, guys, when things don't make sense, when things don't make sense, then you got to go, you got to revert to the most logical, plain, simple situation. And it's by, it's, it's on purpose. Why is it on purpose? I don't know. 
are the electricity companies. I'm gonna put on my tinfoil hat here real quick. You ready? Are the electric companies in on it? Hey, it gets darker sooner. We gotta put on the lights more. I don't know. It's messing with people's mental health. We need more medication. Pharmaceutical companies in on it? I don't know, guys. But it's worth asking the question. You know what I mean? Is this when all the networks and everybody releases their movies and their TV and they want to make sure that people are at home and not out and about? I don't know. I don't know. I'm just asking the questions. Hands are up. Just asking the questions. 319. Damn, we need to get gas there. Oh, wait. I don't have my PJ's card, though. Damn it. We'll get expensive gas. He's so tired today, guys. We've been out and about all day. Out and about. He got to see some of his aunts and uncles today. Yes, he did. Got a lot of love in the club. Yes, he did. And he's tired. All right, guys. I'll catch up with the chat in one second. Oh, that guy has a charger. That's like one of my dream cars. Oh, that thing is gorgeous. All right, here we go. Uh, Michelle, hello from PA. Hello. Paula, brisket is style and profile. You guys already know. Love brisket sweater. I know. I know it's his little cutie sweater. I'm debating on getting him another one so he has a little wardrobe. I, I think brisket has more clothes than I do, to be honest. Wow, Chick-fil-A is packed. Look at this, guys. Look at this. Look at this. Chick-fil-Izzle said... We're gonna pack it up here. Don't worry about it. Holy guac. All right, well, this will be in line for a little bit, just for a milkshake. Uh, day 32, hi, brisket slaying the sweater. Hello, uh, Mischief Muffin. Mischief Muffin, did you used to go by a different name? I feel like your uh, little emoji, I feel like your little emoji is looks familiar. All right, I'm gonna put the window down for brisket, but put the put the heat blasting on him so you can get so you can just live his best life. Oh my God, it goes way back over here. Wow. Oh crap! It's literally wrapped around the building. That's insane in the membrane. You know, I got to give it to Chick-fil-A. You know why? Because I think that they're just, they're probably one of the most consistent fast food places. I think they're one of the most consistent fast food places. Wow, this is a big line. All right. U-Haul, what's popping? Michelle, Christmas already? I know. Yeah, technically, I mean, you know, um, Thanksgiving gets kind of shafted a little bit. But yeah, after, after, uh, after what you call it? After Halloween, Mariah Carey gets defrosted, and all she wants for Christmas is you. Uh, love the hat, Papa Loop. Your face makes me smile. Stop it. This little face right here? What's well, not little, but this face right here? Oh, that was a bad place to park. Uh-oh, we're going to get demonetized. But it's a good Riri song. Why would, I would never, like in a busy place, I would never park where the line is forming and starting. That's brutal. Oh, damn. They're taking orders way up here. I like it. All right, guys, give me one second. I promise I'll, I'll catch up. How you done? Thank you. Managers out here corralling. Styling, profiling. There we go. Ooh, we kind of cut the, oh, they open. We just cut the line. Oh my God, I feel bad. Right Aid, I did shorts. I did shorts on already. I got some Q 
cute discounted stuff for my sister's dog at Five Below. Whoa. Really? They have doggy stuff at Five Below? I didn't know that. We should have been here since the road trip days on the West Coast. Just a new name. Yeah, I recognize. How you doing, bud? How are you? Can I sure, uh, sure. Lupe, L U P E. What can I do for you? Um, I'm gonna do a. Uh, you did you guys just come out with a new milkshake? The peppermint. Uh, yeah, we have a caramel at the moment, but peppermint's back next week. Next week, damn it! All right, sorry about that. That's okay. What was uh, caramel crumble? Yes, sir. And what's the other flavors you have? Uh, so we have a cookies and cream, strawberry, chocolate, vanilla. Cookies and cream. Let's go with cookies and cream. All right. Anything else? Yeah, I'm gonna take uh, um, the grilled nuggets. Just the nuggets. What are they coming again? Eight Six? twelve thirty. 8, 12, 30. Uh, let's go 8. Alright, anything else? And just some Chick-fil-A Chick sauce. Right. And that'll do it. 12.35. Thanks so much. They don't give you guys heaters in here? Oh, there we are. Okay. Have a good one. All set. Thank you. Stay in the right lane? Uh, yes, please. Absolutely. Yes, please, sir. You know what? I'm really sad that they don't say the... They don't say the... Uh, my pleasure and I get it it's a tough economy tough to find uh, tough to find help but like Chick-fil-A of the past man oof. that place would uh, like I felt like they were gonna loan me money all right I love pepper oh guys so the pepper one's not coming in until next week I got really excited I think a turkey day theme flavor is animal animal apple cinnamon i got my cat a halloween costume at five below he was a hot dog you made your cat a hot dog you know your cat was a little like what the heck is going on here uh they are getting new seasonal coffee drinks and ice cream soon i know i know i was excited i was gonna get the milkshake tonight and then i think it's a peppermint iced coffee I was going to grab that tomorrow, but it doesn't look like we're doing that now. Uh, let's see. I got to go back here a little bit. Hello, sir. And brisket sweaters in style. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you, Jeff. Of course, Ruby Ann. Uh-oh. Is Ruby Ann in the building? I don't get it. It gets me so tired. Daylight saving sucks. It sure does. I love when it's dark early. See, Carrie, I'm kind of with you. I'm like 50-50. But I just know that it affects so many people that it sucks. That's I'm I'm really my thought process is more for others. It's it's just how I am. Uh, Ruby Ann said, "Sweet of you to ask." Hold on, I meant to put a smile. What's wrong, Ruby Ann? Uh oh. Do you have Disney Plus? And if so, have you seen the new season of Loki yet? No, I don't have Disney Plus. Actually, the only apps I have, guys. And I'm actually getting rid of, uh, I'm getting rid of, I'm getting rid of Netflix at the end of this month. So that means that the only one I'm going to have is Amazon Prime. And I forgot which one Adam gave me. Wait, a friend of mine's letting me use her Paramount Plus. She's letting me... It's actually a girlfriend of a friend. It's so funny. On there it says her name, the boyfriend's name, mom, dad's name, and then Lupe. And <laughs> hey, I'm part of the fams. Don't worry about it. All right? I'm out here just living a tribal life. We're all sharing here. Um... And then I think Adam, Adam used to, Adam used to have Apple, Apple TV, Hulu, but I think he got rid of all of them. He goes through this thing where like, he just dissects everything. Mm -hmm. Yes. Your name on your order? Uh, Lupe. Right here for you. Perfect. Thank you so much. Sure. Appreciate it. Right Thank you. Shaw's in the back. You're all set. All set. Thank you. Like that guy. See, he's like old school. That's an old school Chick-fil-A guy right there. He got, he got some of that good training. Whoa, we almost went over the curb. All right, Brisket, where the heck can we park? We're not parking by Chick-fil-A. We're going to park by Denny's because there's nobody at Denny's. 
I'm surprised Denny's is still open. Oh, damn it. There was this one big area, but someone's parked over there. And we're not going to do what other people do to us and kill their vibe while they're eating. So we'll go over here. Breakfast, lunch, dinner, late night. Is anybody in this car? Nope. All right. We're Gucci. Let's roll this up to get it heated in here again real quick. Frisky Bear, you want a little bit of whipped cream before Daddy goes in on it? Oh, right there. Good boy. All right, guys, give me one second. Got to clean up now. Wait, so what's what's going on with Ruby Ann? YouTube Red? No, I don't have anything with uh, YouTube Red. Congrats on the Dunkin' box brisket. I know. Th he's so excited about it. Hospitality is a lost act in the fast industry. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Frosted Paramount. Paramount. Peppermint coffee coming soon at Chick-fil-A. Yeah, does anybody know? People skills. New England's worst place for it. Eh, that's not true. You know, there's a... Uh, what? They don't say my pleasure. My son works for them and they must say it. Yeah, Paula, some of them don't say it. Um, wait, I want to go back. What happened to Ruby Ann? She's putting sad faces? What's that? What's happening here? I meant to put... Oh, she meant to put a smiley face. Or did she? Or did she, guys? Hey, Jeannie, how are you? Or did she? We never know what the heck. You know what, guys? We might stop by Five Below. I'm not even going to ask if I can bring brisket in there. We're just going to bring them. Sometimes it's better to ask for forgiveness. All right, guys. Wow, I've been craving something like this all day. Let me get some of this whipped cream. I'm salivating. Oh, they use the good stuff. Not that, like, super oily stuff at the other places. Mmm. If you guys were not in here right now, I'd be licking the hell out of this thing. A little ton tornado in here. Mmm. Wow. One second, guys. Mmm. Oh, she's too thick, which I love, but got to give it a little minute here. Mmm. Okay. So there's a famous meme or there's like a famous video and I'm going to see if I can try to find it. But it basically said the difference between uh, people in big cities and, and compared to um, uh, more smaller areas like a Rhode Island, like a Southeast Massachusetts, you know, New England is, you know, probably our only biggest city is Boston, but even the rest of New England isn't as big as Boston. Uh, so we're all kind of considered small town, right? Like the town that I'm in, I don't know. It's in the thousands. It's definitely not in the hundreds of thousands. It's way below that, but they say that the difference between like people from like the Midwest or New England compared to people from like New York and LA is that people from New from New York, LA and big towns like that, what they'll do is they'll be nice to your face. Like let's say you broke down on the side of the road, they'll be nice to your face and say, Oh, is everything okay? I hope everything's okay. You know, da da da, here's triple A, blah blah blah. But they won't help you. They won't do anything to help you. They'll just like, they'll be nice surface level, but not help you. But people from like the South, Midwest and New England and smaller uh, population areas uh, will like, <laughs> we'll talk crap to you, but then we'll tell you to get out of the way and then we'll, we'll help you with like fix a tire. So we'll, so the difference is like someone from a big city would be like, be like oh like so sorry that's everything happening you know hopefully your day uh goes better 
and then just leave. But in our area, what we'll do is be like, oh, what an idiot. What were you thinking? And then push you out of the way and then help you fix your tire and get you on your way. So like that's the difference. And, and what prompted me saying that story is uh, I think it was you haul in there or someone else in there said that New England uh, hospitality or something like that is different. It's just different. It's different here. It's like, it's like, uh, I don't know. I, I just can't explain it, but it's so different. I told you guys a story when I came back from the road trip in, uh, in Tennessee. Uh, I came back home. I went to the car wash and the guy was like just cursing up a storm. He's like, I don't freaking know it. It's a car wash blah, 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 and all this. But he was helping me along the way. You know, the difference in a bigger city would be like, they would be like, oh, yeah, sorry, we can't do that. And they'll be very like customer service forward and then not help you whatsoever. So that's the difference. All right, let's get some nuggies in us. We got some nugs for the thugs. How much were these? Did we just, we got charged like 13 and change. Prices have really gone up, huh? And this is basically just one. I feel like I should just buy the sandwich next time and then just take out the patty because this looks like it's just a patty that they break up. Sounds good. All right. New England people are true blue. Not like anywhere I've ever been real soul to the earth Manchester New Hampshire ooh that's a beautiful place I love Manchester by the sea fun fact my son's Chick-fil-a is a beginning delivery via drone within a mile radius they're the first Chick-fil-a to do this ooh what um what town is he in I'm sure it's one of the big cities But let me just get all this charred grill stuff out of here. East of Tampa. Oh, is that the like Ybor, Ybor, Ybor City area? Uh, Ruby Ann said, "Aw, my mom and dad ate there all the time. She hasn't gone to Denny's since he passed away last year. I think that was their place." Oh, wait, I just did what Ruby Ann said. That's special. I like that. I used to go to Denny's a lot back in the day. I don't know what happened. I think it's because, you know, Denny's is one of the few places that's open 24 hours, right? I feel like somebody's watching me over here. Um, Denny's is one of those places that's open 24 hours. And then, you know, when I used to be a night owl, now I go to bed like wicked early unless I got to work. Um, we used to just go to Denny's. We used to have a local place here called Bickford's. That doesn't exist anymore, unfortunately. Further east, Brandon. Got it. I feel like I saw that. And then south is a place called Bradenton. We were there for a little bit. I was craving this Chick fil A sauce. Mmm. That was good. All right, buddy, relax. I'm giving you the big ones. This is so ra random. But isn't there a Denny's in the Santa Claus movie? I don't know. They liked it because it was never super packed during the weekday. Makes sense. They just get in and out. Sometimes I'll, uh, I mean, let's be honest, guys. You know, sometimes I really only eat fast food on camera. But, you know, what I what I've found recently is that, you know, sometimes if I'm at, like, McDonald's just to get, like, a quick cheap soda, which they're not cheap anymore. I mean, I guess they're technically still cheap, but it just sucks that everything's going up. Um... I find myself just grabbing a quick double cheeseburger and that's just because I got stuff to do, man. Got stuff to do. 
And I'm sure when they used to go to Denny's, it used to be really fast because there was nobody there. So they get their food really fast. But I love when people have like, see, I'm such a freaking, I wish I can rip this part out of me, this stupid, hopeless, romantic part. It's broken my heart so many times, but um, the, uh, like when people have songs or a, like a, you guys know what I'm saying? Like uh, some, you know, some, I was at, I was talking to some of my friends recently about, you know, some of this stuff and some people don't have like special songs. I was like, are you kidding me? Like one of the first things I do, I'd be like, yo, we're locking down a song right now. All right, buddy. Last one. We are locking down a song right now. And it can't be a recycled one that you use with the next. We got to figure out a new song. Good thing new songs come out all the time. special place. I love that Denny's was your special their their special place. What the heck was that? Mmm. That's delicious. Hold on guys, they're coming really fast. Hey guys, hope everyone's doing well. Hey Taylor. Present all day. Uh, Lupe found the perfect house with a guest shack and six acres. What a brook in the back. One fifty nine. Damn, that's part. That's like cheap. Where'd you find it? Like on Landwatch or something? One of those sites. Uh, BK Brownstone. Why'd you move to Toronto? Just Oh, that's a long story. And I think I, I've, I've talked to... It's a super long story. We don't have enough time to talk about it tonight. But I think I've gotten into that in previous videos. It's actually a cool story. I've never been to Denny's. Thank you. Yes, Lindsay. He takes his son there because he burns the turkey. <laughs> I don't understand all the hate to get. I don't know. Um, BK, so BK, if you're, if you're new here, welcome, by the way, everybody welcome, um, what was the BK Brownstone Uno? BK, if you have a name, well, uh, is BK from, are you from Brooklyn? Um, uh, my buddy Adam is flying in next week and we're going to be telling stories about how we met, how I came to Rhode Island and all that stuff. So make sure you stick around for those lives. I'll, we'll be get, we'll be diving into those. Zillow. What town was it in, Margaret? Tom, what's up, everybody? Senor, Senor Cigar. All right, guys, let's go check out this five below. People are telling me. People are telling me. I'm reading on the interwebs. That five below has some cutie. Five below. Has some cutie pet stuff. Wait, why is it trying to take me to Smithfield? Isn't there one in Arbor? Yeah, there's one in Attleboro. Why would it tell me to go to Smithfield? See, this is why I don't like this. I'm not a big fan of this GPS. All right, let's hit the road. Hitting it. Let's go check out Five Below, even though it's not Five Below anymore. What's their new slogan? Five and more below? Or five, it's probably Five Below and more. I bet you that's what it is. Because there are some things that are technically under five bucks.
Just give me the lights and let's go to five below. Man, people are out. I love this. I'm just glad not everyone's home. Whoa. It's so funny. I went, uh, I drove through a couple towns yesterday. And I'll tell you, man, it's tough. I've, you know, there used to, there's areas that used to be so busy in Rhode Island. Eh, it's just a sprinkle. It's like this sprinkle. That's why I love, I love the concept that, uh, and you, again, we're not going to get political, but I just love this one thing um, that Andrew Yang was all about. It was called the, it was called the Freedom Dividend. And it, it's actually been proposed like throughout history. It's not a new concept. It, om it actually almost passed back in the day, like way back in the day, it almost passed. Um, and basically what it is, is, you know, every single American gets a thousand dollars a month. Now, some people will argue and say, oh, you know, people are just not going to work and they're just, they're just going to this, that, and the other, and this, that. it's like, what the heck is going on? So, you know, first of all, I don't know who can survive off of 10, uh, off of 12 grand, but if they can, I feel like they deserve to go for it. You figured out a way how to live off of 12 grand. We love you. Go do it. Uh, but what it does for the vast majority of us, because most of us are in that, you know, basically there's like the working poor all the way up to like upper middle class. And then after that, it's just the one percenters, which the one percenters are, are mad at Mr. Beast right now. Cause Mr. What Mr. Beast is doing, he's like, he's giving people like, he's paying for people like eyesight. He paid for like a hundred people to have their eyesight back. He's building wells in Africa. Like he's doing all this stuff. And I, I heard rumblings that the 1% is like mad at him because they're like, all right, you're not supposed to show people that you can do all this stuff. <laughs> and we're out here just hoarding the money. So anyways, um, the $1,000 a month, you know, what it does for most of us is maybe, you know, maybe a couple, maybe one of them can afford to finally go take night classes, right? So that they can move up in their company or learn a new skill. Um, some folks might need it, you know, if they're working at a job that's probably going to not be there in a couple years, they can start training for another field. Um, maybe a family, um, who is living, you know, not, maybe not paycheck to paycheck, but you know, maybe they've never had enough money to go on a freaking vacation. Now they have a little bit of money to go on a vacation, right? Um, a vast majority of folks, I was one of them too. You guys saw the Subaru. We're all driving super old cars that are costing more money to maintain. Maybe folks have a little bit extra money for a down payment on a car, maybe afford a car note for once. Uh, maybe someone wants to use it for a down payment for a home. They'll save up for a year, put the $12,000 down for a home. And the funny thing too, right? And it makes sense. A lot of the, is it this street? No, it's the next one. And you know who's for it? Elon Musk. Uh, who's the Amazon guy? Uh, Bezos. Bezos, whatever the heck his last name is. All these like uh, industry titans are for it. You know why? Because the rest of us don't have the luxury like the one percenters to just hoard the money. We're actually pouring it back into uh, society. We're pouring it back into the economy. Wow. It looks creepy over here. So it's interesting. And plus, you know, AI is going to take a crap ton of jobs. Robotics are going to take, we just heard about, uh, her son working at a Chick-fil-A that's doing drone delivery, right? Robotics and AI is going to eliminate, it's going to disrupt our whole ecosystem. And, you know, nine out of 10 of those projects, guys, are funded by, are funded by what? We talked about this the other day. American taxpayer dollars. 
we're the ones that give out the grants and the seed money for all these big advancements in pharmaceuticals, in robotics, in AI, in technology, in everything, in everything. So the argument is, you know, if it's the taxpayers paying for this stuff, we should be able to enjoy the advancement and the success of America as a whole. And there you go. And by the way, this isn't, um, this isn't on top of, so, you know, he made it very clear. He said, this is not on top of other assistance. So if you're already getting like $4,000, right? $4,000 on social security. It's not on top of that. If you're already receiving other assistance, it's not on top of that assistance. It just has to equal out to that much. So it's a fascinating thing. It's a fascinating concept. And let's be honest, you know, when we were getting those, when we were getting those stimulus checks, right? Did anybody save those? I'm sure there's a small percentage of people that were like saving for like a rainy day. Oh, and that's another thing too. Folks can pay off their debt. Folks can pay off their debt, their credit card debt, which alleviates. I have a friend right now who is putting all his debt on one credit card because he is so freaking tired of all the fees, not, not the fees, the interest rates. So he was able to find a, so he's putting it all in one credit card and he's just gone. He said for, he worked it out. He said for 15 months, he's going to tighten the hell out of his belt. And then just get out of that because it is absolutely just the credit card debt is crushing him. So it'll give folks pay that off, pay this off, pay this off, save a little for an emergency, a little bit of money for this, that. So it's a very, very interesting thing. And, um, you know, it's so much more beneficial than, you know, these weird tax breaks that, you know, some some folks, uh, some presidents give out because, what happens is when they give out those tax breaks, it usually only benefits the super rich and they take away from the rest of us. Like I remember one, uh, one year, I wasn't able to write off uh, mileage, right? Who does that affect? Do you think that affects the rich people or the rest of us, right? I couldn't write off my mileage. Um, uh, a buddy of mine was moving cross country for a new job he wasn't able to write off those moving costs like all this stuff they it just sounds nice right tax break and it's like oh yeah tax break but it's all it's just all nuts that's why i like i, I like that concept of of andrew yang's i think it was great and he just put out a meme recently he's like oh, i wish somebody who was running for president brought this up a while ago because he was like on a green screen in front of a, an article saying that AI and some of has taken away like hundreds of thousands of jobs. And it's like, it's only going to get worse. You okay, bud? Is it too hot in here? All right. I paid off my debt from stimulus checks. See? Everybody spent it. Everybody spent it and it did exactly what it was supposed to do. It stimulated everything. Because... I have a friend who bought a $2,000 cat, but she bought it from a breeder and that breeder now has money to go to Marshalls, to go to Old Navy, Ulta, maybe go to Panera, Longhorn, Lens Crafters, Five Below. You know, the money's going back in. I invested my checks. There you go. You invested it to have it grow, right? What does that do? The broker makes money. That money is now going to make you more money so that when you retire, risk it. Guys, I don't know how to do this. I wish Shanice was in here. He just learned. He must have heard another dog. He just learned how to whine. And it's no bueno. It's no bueno. No whining, buddy. Uh, happier, happier at home. Brisket? No, no, baby. We, we gotta, let's not make that a thing. Okay. Kept people at work longer. Let's try those kids. Yeah, that's another thing too. You had, now you have enough money for daycare. 
Now you have enough money for, you know, childcare and all this other stuff. Hey, it's okay. Oh man, I'm gonna have to read up on that. I think I know the freaking dog that he heard it from too. See, if we were living up in the mountains, he wouldn't have learned how to do that. <laughs> Instead, you'd be... All right, so let's see. Columbia. Oh, Columbia. Okay, we'll do. Hello, Molly. Hello. Just want to make sure I'm saying hi to everybody. Hello, Tom. All right, guys. Let's go in here real quick. He's just a baby. I know he's just a baby. But. He never had that baby trait until he heard another dog do it. And now I'm going to go yell at that person. I'm going to be like, what did you do to my dog? All right. I need a cart for brisket. Oh, I found one. Okay. Brisket bear, no whining. No whining, baby. Okay. Let's go see if they have dog stuff here. You're gonna fit perfect in there, buddy. Fam. All right, fam, bam. Here we go. Look at brisket. <laughs> Why you look so cute, buddy? You look so cute. Oh no, we're gonna get demonetized again. Hold on. I gotta stop going into stores. I'm gonna get another copyright in here. Oh, why are they always pumping music? Jesus, it keeps getting louder. Okay, here we go. I think I found it. Oh 
my god. Look at this. Oh my god, brisky baby. Yeah, he'll pop up and out. <laughs> Brisket. No? Okay. He'll pop in and out. Wow, they have a whole... Was this Margaret? Thanks, Margaret. They have so much stuff here. Oh, my God. And this is my Christmas. I never heard of this song. Hi, baby. Hi, babes. You good? Yes. That's a good boy. Oh, where are you going? Oh. I grew up not far from Manchester. Pup influencer. Chick-fil-A sounds so good. All right. I like this too. Let's see if we can find hugs and shrugs. That's funny. Chase your dreams. Get it? Because it's a dog. Wait, they only have this one though. We're going to have to go to a different one. See if we can get a smaller. He's not a large. Are you a large? No? Okay. Yeah, they don't have any other sizes here. Chase your dreams. Oh, we're right here. Small, small, medium. Okay. Let's see. Oh, 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 oh. How are you? Yeah, his name's Brisket. <laughs> Good boy. Uh, he's a year and a half. Yeah. Good boy. Does he go crazy around your house? Yeah. Yeah, Jack Russell's are a little nuts. Uh, we have a boxer mix. Yeah. He's four and he still acts like a puppy. Yeah. Oh, he's definitely... He just has a... I wish I had, like, a big piece of land that he can run around yeah. in. You know what I mean? All right, let's see here. Um, it is to run. Oh, so open sleigh. <laughs> I like that. Positively fun. Let's see what's in here. Oh, bad fur day. How freaking cute. Are you serious? We gotta get one of these too, right? It's only four bucks. All American dog. I love it. He needs like thick stuff though, like this. Ugh. You know this pajama party. <laughs> Margaret, you hit the you hit the freaking gold mine. Ugh. That's a small brisket. A large? No. I think the large is too big. Yeah, too big. Alright. This song is definitely gonna get the masa. What about this guys? <laughs> you having a bed for a day? I know, you get nervous. You get nervous sometimes. That's the chihuahua in you. I don't know why you're nervous sometimes. It's okay. Let me open this up. He might be hot. Are you hot? Hold on, guys. better they're so warm sorry yeah oh yes i'm sorry his name's brisket <laughs> we didn't even know you guys did you guys always have uh pup stuff yeah we're super super pet friendly oh my god oh you're so sweet you are shaking yeah i thought maybe he was warm but i think he's just nervous i took off, I took off his sweater oh boy Oh boy, yeah. 
is beautiful. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Good boy. Yes. All right, let's see here. Oh my God, look at this, guys. Maybe we'll get this another day for New Year's Eve. Get out of here. Look how dapper you would look, sir. Look at this. <laughs> He's so cute. He's popular, oh, everyone loves him. Halloween stuff with was discounted to two bucks, really? It wasn't you, I thought it was you. I'm at five below, Tay Tay. He's a, he's a pup influencer, we're in our standard group. Yeah, so these are the two that we're thinking about getting them. Pup, pup influencer. And then when he's having a bad fur day, get it? <laughs> oh, this one's dirty, ooh. Oh wait, it's not dirty, it's just wet. It's okay, bud. That's funny. Hey, where's the dad one? My dad made me wear this. This is gonna demonetize us. Monetize us. Oh, look at this. Dream big. Oh my God. How cute is that? He'll hate me for this one. Cause we got you the other one already. Wanna dream big? No, you just nervous? A lot going on. Look at that, been there, chewed that. That's funny. This is kind of cute though. What is this for water and food? We don't need one of those. Actually, we do kind of need one of those. Let's demonetize this video. Do it, can't really hear the music step back. Demonetize, yeah. Demonetize, yeah. Are those also five bucks or like like eight or something? I think they're ten. Ten? All right. Or they're like five fifty-five or something like that. Oh, you got Ooh. hops. Yeah. Five fifty-five. Oh, nice. There you go. Okay. Way better than me, so that's, that's, still, that's still a win. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Oh, this is cool. Oh, okay. Guys, look at this. This is a treat launcher. Should we get this? I don't have any like standard treats from it. All right, let's go. There's more stuff over here, bud. There's more stuff over here. Oh, we need all this. You want some calming? What is this for separation, travel, and environmental stress? I don't know what's in here. Chenise or Rubian? Are these decent ingredients? Let me know. I don't. I don't. Oh, 
Oh, traffic jam. Ooh, look at this, 12 bucks. Dude, there's some good prices here. What do you guys think, huh? Don't waste your money. Yeah, good point. That's why we put it back down. <laughs> Welcome to Brisket Cam. See, I never wanted to get one of these because I didn't know if he was going to use it or not. And I would hate to have this just wastefully there. Yeah, we're not going to get it. You sleep on the... Merry Christmas. Merry, Merry Christmas. Look at this. Should we turn into one of these people? This one's right here. <laughs> I just don't know if he's gonna like this. Are you actually gonna chew on this, bud? No? All right. Oh, look at this. He can be a Coleman dog. My pet feeder, I kind of like that. Alright, bud. I've never heard of any of these songs. Alright, you're stressed out. Let's go. I'm trying to find you another toy though, bud. Oh, there's a bottle in here. Oh, we'll get him this. How cute is this? Oh, I kind of like this. I could put treats in there and have them dig around for it. Paul Light. All right, we're getting this. You guys have some good stuff. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. up here love his toy collection he's building up oh he has a whole container of it now that's cool does he like to play with water bottles I, I've never really exposed him to it that's cool hey right, Ruby and those pink thing oh you guys you guys really love the pink thingies huh These are fancy. I don't know if they're gonna have. Oops, sorry. Hmm. There's no beef for brisket. So. IPA. 
Oh my god. Paul Garino? I can't. It's a baby. It's okay. Alright guys, we're almost out of here. I never heard of this song either. Sounds like Mariah Carey. Sounds like Mariah Carey. As a baby. As a baby. I know we're gonna check out another Five Below, see if they have other letters. Because we're definitely gonna brisket a monogrammed. Those things are usually like $20. I'm surprised that we could find them here for five bucks. Hello. Yep. Hello. Hi. So these aren't self checkout anymore? No. Okay, got it. Unfortunately. That's alright. So we got these four things. Yeah. Would you like a 35 cent reusable bag or? A 35 or. Uh, 35 cent reusable bag. Reusable bag. Sure. Just yeah, no, that's okay. I have, I'm getting old, so I have to like repeat things to myself. <laughs> I was trying to find his letter. I, I, I yeah. couldn't find B in there. I was trying to find Z the other day. Yeah, Z? What do you have, Xavier? No, Zeus. Zeus. Oh. I have a, yeah. Okay. I have a Shih Tzu and Chihuahua mix. Oh, mm -hmm. cutie. Yeah, absolutely. I'll do, uh, we'll do the middle. Yeah. Hi, welcome to Five Below. 21 They kind of look like they have the same fur. Yeah, he, uh, he, he's got a little chihuahua in him, too. Yeah, this is what, uh, mine looks like. Oh. I love, oh I love the color. Me. It's a, they're like perfectly, yep. like wearing a mask. That's awesome. Every time I had a customer that has a dog, I'm like, I have to tell them about my dog. Yeah, I, I didn't know you guys were dog friendly, so now I know. <laughs> How often do you guys get like different stuff for like dogs? Was it like seasonal? No, um, well, for like the Christmas stuff, yes, but um, and like the Halloween stuff, yes, but everything else you usually get on like Tuesdays. Get out of here. You guys get new stuff Tuesdays and Thursdays. Okay, cool. All right, thank you so much. Yeah. Have a good one. You as well. All right, brisky baby. You ready? Look how creepy it looks out here. Look at this. Huh? Why is this not working? Oh, there we go. Look at the fog. Isn't that, isn't that weird? It's like super foggy. Looks like a... Looks like a scary movie. Oops. Put brisket the wrong way. Hold on. One second. So far, we're, we're in a killer slasher movie. They don't have a return cart thing. Alright, I guess that's that. Um, 
we had some leftover uh, from the super chats yesterday, guys, from uh, from everyone the last couple of days. So thank you guys. So that worked out perfectly. Yeah. All right. There we go. Hopefully our milkshake is all is all good to go here. You're a pup fluencer. And you have bad hair days some days, huh? Yeah? He doesn't want to talk about it. Uh, for Christmas is you. My knees just don't know that. Wait, what's going on? Old is a mindset. Oh, yeah. Yeah, my knees... Basically, the whole left side of my body doesn't work. I have a bad left ankle, bad left knee, bad left shoulder. So, is everything okay, bud? You just want to be held for a little bit? All right, you're turning into a baby. How are you turning into such a baby? This is a baby baby. It's so spooky. Oh, I love that red fleece, super cute. Well, did we get something that was red? Oh, the uh, the Santa thingy. Yeah. Mm -mm. Daddy shouldn't even be drinking this. Mm. Old is a mindset, but yeah, our bodies sometimes remind us that it's also actuality. My cats have their own stockings for Christmas. That's awesome. Too funny those toys i know i want i kind of want to go in there one day um i mean shoot we might come here once a week i mean you got all worked up bud you want the window there you go you're gonna get cold though um she said that i don't know if you guys heard but they get new stuff every tuesday and thursdays so it should be interesting to see what they have going on. And honestly, I never shop for myself anyways. I only shop for brisket. That's not fully melted. That's okay. Actually, I just lied to you guys. I did finally buy some pillow covers on, uh, on Amazon for... Uh, those ugly pillows that came with the couch that we got a year, year and a half ago. Uh, so we finally get the colors up and I can't wait. I can't wait. Uh, Amanda. Yeah, I don't know why you guys don't get the, I don't understand how you guys don't get the notifications and you click on it, right? I wonder if maybe you go to the thingy, if you click on notifications, if it shows you different types of notifications and if you can then select all notifications or maybe unclick it and then re-click it I don't know I just feel bad I have never had Chick-fil-a yeah there's a lot of people that I mean I didn't have Chick-fil-a for the until the first time like I don't know, like six years ago but they had been all over the country forever They are the most consistent though. And I think it's because they basically print money so that they can pay to have an army there. Uh, when you picked him up, he stopped panting. Is he faking it? No. I think just part of it, like he's, you guys, you guys have to remember, he's part Chihuahua. So anything, anything can like click him into like getting nervous. So I think this, just me holding them, makes them less nervous. And it's okay. How about those toys you got from Duncan earlier, huh? Spoiled Papa Rooney. Yeah, spoiled. Spoiled. Duncan doesn't send me any any toys. All right, let's head back. Ugh. Got 
เดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเดี๋ยวเ
Uh, let's see, Gregory said, I worked at Chick-fil-A for three months. It didn't work out, but I learned a lot. Put a lot of dots there. Uh-oh. Amanda, I finished Britney Spears' new book. I kind of liked reading. It's relaxing, and it kept me off my phone for a few days. Nice. I always wonder how how much uh, truth are in, like, books that celebrities write, you know? Are they trying to, like, make themselves look better, give themselves a pass? Are they trying to make someone else look bad? It's always tough, you know? But at the end of the day, what happened to Britney was kind of unfair, man, especially with the, the whole, uh, I don't know how to say the word, conserv conservatorship. Like, that was messed up. As a matter of fact, she owes that to TikTok, man. All the all the people on TikTok actually got her to get her freedom back because they put so much like emphasis and media attention towards it that it actually it actually powered, which is kind of scary, right? A social media platform can have such an impact on something. <laughs> My nose is itching. What's going on here? Was it good, Amanda? Give us a couple of, uh... no, that's definitely for two. It is? Okay, good. Don't we all just want to be held? That's for damn sure. That's for damn sure. I just want to be held. Orange, orange is my favorite color and brown. Look at you. Look at us, Ruby Ann. Huh? Look at us. Thank you for telling. <laughs> I was about to start teasing you again, Roman. I was about to say, <laughs> thank you for telling us something about yourself. Unless you're lying. Unless your favorite color is actually purple. We must be getting crazy weather. He only acts like this if we're getting crazy weather. You okay, bud? I can't drink the rest of it. I must have like a Oreo cookie. But thank you, Margaret. That makes me feel a lot better because I would have been very upset if I'm paying $17 for one. And by the way, if anybody doesn't know this, if you have a Capital One credit card um, and it has any kind of like cash back stuff, you can link it to your Amazon account and you can use your reward points on Amazon. So like the last couple things that we purchased on Amazon, we haven't technically had to pay for it. Also, I, I've been influenced. I get influenced all the time. Um, I saw this TikTok about this girl. It was a Korean girl talking about. You guys know the the Korean um, the Korean washcloths. Supposedly, they're supposed to be so good that, like, it if it done if done correctly, it can like really take off all the dead skin and really give you some really soft skin. And then obviously you're supposed to put lotion on it right after. So I bought a six pack for like four or five bucks. So I can't wait to try that out. I'm gonna freak out if like a bunch of dead skin is rolling off of me. But they literally show it on the, why is my nose so itchy? Actually, I shouldn't be touching my face, damn it. I'm gonna touch the door handle. Um, yeah, they have, uh, they have this graphic when you buy it on Amazon that shows like all the, like the gray rolled up dead skin, you know, as you're rubbing it like this. And I was like, oh, that's going to freak me out. So we'll see. We'll see how soft, uh, your boy can get. And then, I, and then I'm ready to be held, Margaret. 
put you right. I always make the joke. I go, oh, I just, I've always wanted to be the little spoon. I'm always the big spoon. All right, here we go. All the robo cameras in the land over here. I feel like we live in some like futuristic movie with all these freaking, all these freaking speed cameras. It's insane in the membrane. Uh, say that again, you broke up. Oh, what? I don't know what I said. I said, I just said a lot there. Oh, that sucks if you guys can't hear me, though. Mm. How about the credit card? Oh. If you have a Capital One card, um, by the way, if you have a Capital One card, I think, and if you sign up for Uber Eats for the first time, they give you like six months free. They literally credit your account. Uh, but what I was saying about Capital One is um, you can you can use your Capital One card on Amazon and then it'll ask you if you wanna link it so that you can use your reward points if you get cash back. What the, am I allergic to something? <laughs> Jesus. Um, so all the cash back that you get from Capital One, uh, you'll be able to use those reward, that reward money on your Amazon purchases, which is perfect for me. I mean, we don't buy that much anyways. Like those, those pillow covers are like a splurge for me, for me. I don't mind spending money on brisket, but for me, I just don't like buying stuff for me. And um, so yeah, it'll, it'll link it there. I, I was trying to save up all the reward money to the end of the year to see how much I got back. But, you know, we ended up buying like our greens powder. I think I bought uh, some vitamins. We bought a couple things for brisket. We bought his like toothpaste and stuff. So all those things, you're good now. How about, uh, okay, I'm good now. All right, guys, but we're, I'm gonna take Brisket out for another little walk here. Thank you guys for chilling with me. Day 32, tomorrow's 33. Uh, for tomorrow's live, I was thinking about, cause I was, I was cleaning up the studio because Adam's coming into town and you know, I had a, I had a bunch of projects and like boxes of things that I had to move around. Um, and I found my buddy Terry, uh, who owns a local clothing brand called uh, Rhode Island Original. He gave me an MRE, right? Adam the Woo? No, not Adam the Woo. He's not here anymore anyways. He's, uh, I think he's like he's in Virginia now. Hold on one second. There it is. Woo, that was a late bloomer. That was a late bloomer. Um, no, my buddy Adam. Um, he, wait, what was I saying? Oh, my buddy Terry. Uh, thank you, Lindsay. My buddy Terry gave me an MRE, but it's from France. It's a French MRE. How cool is that? And I was looking at the box and I was like, oh man, I wonder if it's expired. And it doesn't expire until next year. So maybe for tomorrow's live, we'll do a, uh, a French military uh, MRE. I thought that would be kind of fun. Mix it up a little bit. Um, so hopefully everyone's doing great. Oof, I'm actually getting a little warm. Um, yeah. Thanks for chilling again, guys. Tomorrow's day 33, officially one third of the way in. Hopefully you guys had fun tonight. It was great chilling. Um, I'll leave the chat open for an extra 30 seconds. Uh, so everyone can say good night. Lindsay, I won't be able to make it tomorrow. Oh no. Oh wait, oh, cause tomorrow's Friday. Oh damn, Lindsay, you got a date, date night. Let me find out. Lindsay from Boston, going out on the town. 
Good night, Angel. Good night, Tay Tay. Well, you'll be able to catch the live. I mean, they 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 post anyways. Unfortunately, this one uh, is gonna get demonetized. That was way too many. Um, I'm definitely gonna get a copyright uh, claim on this on this video, which sucks. Um, uh, because there was way too much copyright music in Five Below, but now I know. Now I know that. So. I wish that there was a way where YouTube would give you a feature where you can click to muffle copyright music, but it still picks up my voice. They should work on that because it's not our fault that we're going into a store that's playing music over. It's not like we're recording at a concert. We're not doing this on purpose. Sound. That was a creepy sound. Okay, I think we're good. My fiance's sick. All right, till eleven. I have to chaperone a middle school dance. Ugh. Oh my God, Margaret, that's a crazy age to chaperone. Everyone have a good night. All right, Margaret. Everybody. One. Every single chat. What we'll do is we'll pick one person and we'll all send them positive energy. How about that? So this chat's positivity overload, positive energy is going to go to Margaret for tomorrow. Chaperoning a middle school dance, holy guacamole. I wouldn't even do that. So you are a great person. Yeah, Lindsay, hopefully, right? Good luck. Should be fun. All right, guys. Good night. As always, guys, be well, eat well, and make sure you guys take care of each other, okay? All right. Have a good night. I'll see you guys tomorrow.